Grab your next nine holes while holding a beer and not even walking a block. The 19th hole is a summer tradition. Ah! Going back to 2015. The parking lot across from the boutique Hotel Deluxe transformed into a beautiful flower-filled putt-putt hangout. Some of them are a little challenging. It's been fun to play around with them and get the right shots and learn how to make sure that we can actually make it in. <laughs> it's back and so are the 130 rooms and amenities. Hotel Deluxe closed down in March 2020 when the world came to a grinding halt and travel stopped. This property was fully closed, so no caretakers were on property during this time. So it's been a process to get everything brought back to life, turn on all the lights, take all the plastic off the beautiful chandeliers, and welcome our guests. The concierge, the bellhops, they're all back. There's even a new chef, Benjamin Waterman, formerly with Departure. I think it's every chef's goal to have autonomy and creative freedom. We have seven different vegetarian items on our menu, four of which are um, completely vegan, gluten-free, and dairy-free. You'll also find favorites like a fried chicken sandwich, tacos, buffalo cauliflower bites, or spring rolls, all for order at the 19th hole. Soon, Gracie's, the fine dining restaurant inside, will open for reservations. And then the famously dark and alluring cocktail lounge, the Driftwood Room in the hotel lobby, will follow. Deluxe has been following the travel market closely and is encouraged. We're seeing the increase in bookings of the properties around the city. We're seeing more and more people get out of their homes and come enjoy staycations, come from even just the outskirts of Portland. Connect Four, pop a shot, giant wooden Jenga, as silly as all that, and a gargoyle on a putt-putt green R. This is the kind of stuff that will activate downtown Portland again getting families and kids and yes pets down here to give our city a breath of fresh air and put a positive vibe back on the streets.